Hi, it's Russ from Pro Tools Expert, and it's been a bit of time since I made a video, but I saw this new free plugin from DMG Audio yesterday, which for Pro Tools users will be a godsend because it's it offers to door users the ability to have lots of features you'd have on a, a conventional console uh, on each track. The first thing I want to show you is I've got three instances already on here, and as you can see, it's showing. Well, it's just about trying to be at 1%. It gives you lots of really cool at-hand things that you often want very quickly that you're often using plugins to use. And so this is all in one place. You've got trim in, trim out. You've then got MS to LR, and you can swap the left and right channels. Uh, you've got a phase switch here as well. Uh, you've got a high-pass filter. Just roll that in. Uh, and that's got variable slope as well. And very useful on any mix. You've got a balance control if you've been sent a, 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 a got a stereo loop, for example, and it's a bit wacky, it's, it's, it's offset to one side, for example, you can balance it up. You can change the width to such a degree you can actually create stuff in mono or go wacky wide stereo, kind of send the phase meters out of control. You then got pan both sides as well as uh, the mid and side option if you want by pressing that there. Then you've also got a delay. So all of that across the channel. So I'll show you it in action. So let me just play you this track. So as I say, I've got this, this drum kit going on here. Let me just make sure I'm on the right version of this. Uh, high pass filter. Depending on how big a slope you want. So that's very useful to start with. You've got a phase. It's just literally just throwing it 180 no variable. So you've got MS to LR and you can swap the left and right channels as well. Uh, you've then got a width. So let's put that where it should be. So that's the actual width it was recorded at and as I say phase switch it, swap it if you want the high outs on the other side or whichever side you want them and then you as I say the width can take you right into mono and right across into completely wild super wide so that far so you get all sorts of places so I, I like that one particular I sometimes get to overheads or rooms and they're, they're too wide for what I want so I'm gonna have to pull them in a bit without having to use the, the pan controls actually on the channel is good then you have the balance so you can as I say balance up a stereo pair which is great got the pan left and right And of course, they could also work in MS mode instead. And finally, got a delay. And you think, well, what's the point of delay? Well, it's a couple of points. One, obviously, if you've got stuff that's slightly uh, out of out of t time on the track, you can instead of sliding the audio around physically on the track, you can use the delay instead. The other cool thing is, of course, if you've got I've got a bass part here. Let's go to that. I can then push it ahead or behind the beat. And of course you've also got an in and out control for trimming it. So you can, if you haven't got enough gain coming down the channel for things like uh, compressors or you want to back it off, you can then do that as well. So uh, it's a bargain at free. So I think it's an excellent little plugin, especially say for Pro Tools users who've been asking for things like phase switches, filters, all that kind of stuff. Very, very useful little plugin. Works on all platforms. Click the link to find out more. Thanks for watching and I'll see you again soon.